All right, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna be watching Game of Thrones season six, episode nine. Episode nine. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I did see the title of this episode, and I did, and I see that it is called Battle of the Bastards. I think I know what that means. I think I know. I think I know what time what time it is. You know, by context clues tell me, well, John's a bastard, Ramsey's a bastard, you know, the tension between them's heating up, so, but, you know, they're gonna fight, basically. I think this is it. You know, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda, uh, okay, I'm kinda nervous for this episode, just because I feel like John's making the same mistake Stannis did, where he's fighting too early with not enough men. You know, like, Stannis literally foreshadowed that when he was talking with Sam, like, a couple episodes before. I feel like John's making the same mistake. But then again, at the same time, John already died. So it's like, they're not, he's not gonna die this quick again. Unless. <laughs> unless. I don't think so. I don't think so. Unless we just get a, a fat army out of nowhere to come help us, then, like, yeah, like, Peter and the Veil come through, boom. And then like, okay, I can see it's kind of working out. So I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're just gonna hop right into this episode. If you'd like to watch the full length reaction, that would be available on Patreon. As well, early access to the next two episodes of Game of Thrones will also be available on Patreon. So let's get started. Oh, my God! oh yep, we're picking up at Marine. Oh yeah, we still gotta deal with this. I mean, shit, I hope the Ironborn come through, but I feel like they'd get here, they would, it would be way too quick for them to get here. But that would earn her trust if they came through and saved them right now. You know, in the water. Commerce has returned to the markets. The people are behind you. <laughs> but the rebirth of Marine is the cause of this violence. She is not having this. It proves that no one needs a master. Mm -hmm. Good. Just. I will set their fleets afire, kill every last one of their soldiers, and return their cities to the dirt. I like that plan. Where are the Darth Raki at? Did she bring him? He would have burned every one of his citizens. The loyal okay. ones. I'd like to suggest an alternate approach. Oh, shit. You could have returned to your homeland with a fleet of ships. And nah. You will flee Slaver's Bay on foot. Like the beggar queen. Not a bitch. The unsullied you stole from Krasny's Mona Claus will remain to be sold again to the highest bidder. No. Fuck no. This Mona Claus will remain to be sold again to the highest bidder. Nope. Dragons beneath the Great Pyramid will be slaughtered. No. Hell no. Yours didn't communicate clearly. <laughs> yeah, no, we had to you... discuss your surrender, not mine. Yeah. <laughs> I imagine it's difficult. Adjusting to the new reality. Your reign is over. Oh, what about ego checking so hard? My reign has just begun. Uh. Is that a dragon? No, right, just do, but just kill them right. Yeah, just kill them right here, dude. Okay, what are you gonna do now? Hell yeah. Yeah, now let's go light all those ships on fire. Get out of my way. <laughs> hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah, our boys are coming out. Damn, so they could have just broke out the entire time. <laughs> Bro, we got three dragons in the air. We're gonna light all these ships on fire. We, we You can't beat us. I mean, yeah, we still gotta deal with all the soldiers on the in the city, but oh, the Dorthraki are here! Oh yeah, oh, we're you're waxed, you're dead, Dario. Damn. 
<laughs> Imagine being on another boat watching that. <laughs> you men have a choice. Yep. Fight and die for masters who would never fight and die for you. Or go home to your families. Nah, the second option is mercy, dude. Alright, yeah, what are you gonna do now? Thank you for the armada. Our queen does love ships. Mm -hmm. Now. Yeah, shit. I mean, if you don't burn all the ships, then you get, you keep a couple. You declared war upon us. Though our queen does have a forgiving nature, this cannot be forgiven. Oh, hell no. Insist that one of you must die. All of you must die. Yeah, kill the dude in the blue. No, not him. No, you should die. You're the most annoying. <laughs> Oh, hell yeah. That was smooth. Tell your people what happened here. <laughs> you live by the grace of Her Majesty. Remind them what happened when Daenerys Stormborn and her dragons came to Marine. Yep. It's a power move. Damn, that was a great scene right there. That was great. It's wonderful. John's gonna meet with Ramsey. I love how uh, House Mormont Queen's in the back. Fuck. My beloved wife. Fuck you. Thank you for returning Lady Bolton safely. Oh, that's not what we're doing, now, buddy. Dismount and kneel before me. Nope. Surrender your army and proclaim me the true Lord of Winterfell and Warden of. All right, all right, all right. Here's what I'm doing. Here's what I'm doing. I'm getting off my horse. I'm going like this. I'm going like that. <laughs> Come. Yeah, yeah. Love her. You don't have the men. You don't have the horses. And you don't have Winterfell. But we have the grit, the term, the determination, the heart, the passion. There's no need for a battle. <laughs> yes, there is. Get off your horse. Kneel. No. I'm a man of mercy. No, you know you're not. <laughs> John will never kneel. Hell. Thousands of men don't need to die. Only one of us. Let's end this the old way. You against me. Ah, that's. I got John. Hundred on John. I got my house on John. <laughs> that's what Jamie tried to do to Rob too, if I remember right. But you, you're the greatest swordsman who ever walked. Maybe you are that good. Maybe not. I don't know if I'd beat you. You won't. But my army will beat yours. Fuck. <laughs> I have 6,000 men. You have, what, half that? Yeah. Not even? Aye. You, you have, have the numbers. Like 20, 300 maybe? Well, your men want to fight for you when they're here. You wouldn't fight for them. Will you let your little brother die because you're too proud to surrender? How do we know you have? Yep, yeah, the dire wolf head. That's so sad. Now, if you want to say You're going to die tomorrow, Lord <laughs> <laughs> Sleep well. Yeah, sleep well. Sad. Oh, I love Sansa. I look forward to having her back in my bed. And you're all fine-looking men. My dogs are desperate to meet you. Mm -hmm. I haven't fed them for seven days. They're ravenous. We'll find out soon enough. It's not, he's not intimidating. He's not intimidating any of them. Busted. I mean, yeah, Ramsey's smart enough to know he won't win against John, just him, but his army will definitely win against John's army, so. I didn't think he'd fall for that, and he didn't, so. If the other houses sense weakness on his part, they'll stop fearing him. One to fight for him, they're forced to fight for him. If they feel the tide turning, it's not this men that. A pincer move. They won't be able to hit us from the sides. <laughs> Good. <laughs> and we'll have him surrounded on three sides. Really think that cunt would fight you man to man? Fuck no. But I wanted to make him angry. Mm hmm. Make him emotional. Have him thinking emotionally, not logically. That's how we're gonna beat him. Did it ever once occur to you that I might have some insight? I've fought beyond the wall against worse than Ramsay Bolton. I've defended the wall from worse mm -hmm. than Ramsay Bolton. You don't know him. Yeah, don't underestimate him. What should we do? How do we get Rickon back? We'll never get him back. Oh. 
As long as he lives, Ramsay's claim to Winterfell will be contested, which means he won't live long. Yeah. We can't give up. Arby. Brother. Listen to me, please. Just don't do what he wants you to do. Oh, that's good advice. Yeah. Winterfell until we had a larger force. Or is that obvious When too? will we have a larger force? We've pleaded with... We're lucky to have this many men. It's not mm. enough. No, it's not enough. It's what we have. If Ramsay wins, I'm not going back there alive. Do you understand me? Yeah. I'll protect you, I promise. No one can protect me. Oh. No one can protect anyone. Okay, that's facts. It wasn't the Boltons defeated Stannis. Stannis himself. Mm hmm No, it's a manner of speaking. Actual demons. Oh. <laughs> Believing in kings. Jon Snow's not a king. No, he's not. But he is the prince that was promised. Like Melisandre said. And what the fuck is she talking about when she says that? She, nothing has been built on that yet, so... I'm not a soldier. Any advice? Don't die. Don't lose. Oh. <laughs> if I do, if I fall, don't bring me back. Mm. Yeah, just let me die this time. Do what he commands. How do you know what he mm. commands? Interpret his signs. Mm. As well as I can. She doesn't sound too confident anymore. Maybe he brought you here to die again. Well, that would be a dick move. Is that something? Is this where they burn Shireen? <laughs> like, oh, it's time. It is time. Watch the sunrise one last time, maybe. Last time we saw each other was at Winterfell, yes? You were making jokes about my height, I seem to recall. <gasps> hey, they made it! Everyone who makes a joke about a dwarf's height thinks he's the only person ever to make it. Okay, look, well, yeah, Theon was kind of a dingus back then. All right, he's a changed man now. It was a long time ago. It was. And how have things been going for you since then? Not great. Not so well, I gather. Got my dick cut off. <laughs> Not my claim. Yes. Mm hmm And what's wrong with you? I don't want it. Has the Iron Islands ever had a queen before? No more nope. than Westeros. Nope. Uh, she, Daenerys is in. Tyrion tells me your father was a terrible king. You and I have that in common. Hmm. He also wants to give you... His big cock. <laughs> I think he said. Mm -hmm. And I imagine your offer is free of any marriage demands. I never demand, but I'm up for anything, really. <laughs> He'll murder you as soon as you have what he wants. Mm -hmm. The Seven Kingdoms. All of them. Yep. And, and took the Iron Islands. We ask you to give them back. And that's, that's all. We'd like you to help us murder an uncle or two who don't think a woman's fit to rule. Reasonable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, reasonable, yep. We're going to leave the world better than we found it. No more. Deal. But... But... Oh no, okay, I guess here we go. Ugh. Okay, I know that giant's taking out at least a hundred people. Before he goes down, if he goes down. Oh, that's a fat army. Oh, oh, who is this? Watch him just kill Rickon in front of him or whatever. Like, fuck. Be... Yeah, just right here while John's watching. Ah. Uh... Music. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Do you like games, little man? Let's play a game. No. <laughs> you can make it to Where that side. The sooner you make it to him, the sooner you get to see him again. They're gonna shoot him, or they're just gonna charge with him. Easy. Ready? As soon as he starts running, there, Ramsey's army's gonna charge. No, you have to run, remember? They're gonna shoot him. Those are the rules. Yep, yeah, oh, okay, Ramsey's just gonna shoot him. Like. 
Fuck, if we have to, if we got, John's going out there himself. Ah, uh, but what if he gets John too? John's horse, you know? It's like. Bro, zig and zag, zig and zag. Are you kidding me? Do not run straight. Wait, you know what I'm doing? I'm going to wait till I hear him shoot it. I'm looking at it and then I'm just going to move out of the way. Like, what? If you can hear it, I don't know. No look. I'm just going to look back every like 10 seconds to see it in the air and I'm just get out of the way. I'm going to get John's horse. John. He's dead. Ah, oh, yeah, he's, that was a quick death. If I think Ramsey's trying to get us emotional, so we charge. Like, when on his terms, I guess. Don't. Yeah, don't. Yeah, we're gonna run right into those arrows. No! Ah! Oh, Rick. Ah. Go, follow your commander. All right, what's the plan? What's the plan? Are we divided or what? What are we doing? Ah. Let's go. It's just a straight charge, I guess. That's slow motion. The intensity is so high right now. Oh, John's going in at first. Ah, ah the horse. No. Now. Cavalry! Ah. Not gonna lie, I've seen this. I've seen this gif a lot. Uh, John! Oh, okay, his voice came through. Okay, thank fucking god. Oh. Oh, the collision, dude. I was just cover on, man. Stand down. Yeah, he would. But Ramsey doesn't care if he does that. Why don't we have the arrow guys, all the archers go to the side and just start arching out Ramsey, you know, from like a different, you know? Oh. God, this is chaos right now though, but John, oh, but John's put in work. Bro, how do you like not accidentally kill your own men too? Like, you're just, I feel, oh, I feel like here it says kill, kill them, whoever you see. <laughs> God damn! That Ramsey has so many men. He doesn't care if he kills the ones he just sent out. Oh, John. <laughs> God, the piles of bodies, god damn. We may as well be checking shits back here. Mama! Hell yeah, Azur Devos. I love to see it. It's time. Go. Fuck. <laughs> Ramsey's a bitch for just sitting there, dude. At least go in and fight, you know? No! Uh. No! No! Bro, what if the White Walkers? Oh, let's go. What if the White Walkers pull up right now? I feel like that's that's oh, pff, that guy's gonna win. It's like one of the. <laughs> it's like it's one of the only ways we're gonna win this. But that's kind of a cop out, so it's not gonna happen. Oh god, they're just gonna surround us. Yeah. 
they're just gonna squish us. I mean, numbers-wise, I feel like we're chilling, but they def but they just have us surrounded. Oh, yeah, see, it's like, what what do we do here? Ah. God damn. Break the Oh, have. <laughs> Try not to run in the spear, though. Oh. Yeah, that would be happening. No, don't die. No, please don't die. Please don't die. Like, I... I don't know what it... Yeah, just charge back the other way. Just sprint the other... I guess. All right, I got John. John's the least killing this guy. Oh, yep, yeah, the wildlings is gonna charge him this way. Yeah, why don't we just do that in the first place? Uh, I'd rather go the other way than just get fucking stabbed to death by a spear. God, John can't even get up. Oh, he's about to suffocate down here. No, not Dorman. No. Ah. 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 He's about to get buried from all the dead bodies. Ah. Uh. Damn. No. Who the fuck? Who the fuck? Who the? It's better be Peter. Peter in the veil. It's better be. This better be Peter in the veil. In the veil. Ah! Yes! Oh, it's Peter in the veil. Hell fucking yeah! But oh, it'll get fucked. It get fucking waxed. Yeah, oh, that's such a relief for John too. Yep, Sansa got him. But Ramsey just knows he got flanked so fucking hard. Ah. <laughs> yes. Oh, just run them all over. <laughs> oh, John, I'm gonna go kill him on myself right here. Yeah, Ramsey, what are you gonna do now? Oh, that. Yep. Oh, hell yep. Let's go kill him ourselves. The 3v3 right here. <laughs> yes. Look how dirty John is versus Ryan. Yeah, he's gonna run away like a bitch. But look, look how dirty John is versus Rams. He's just. John's a true leader for actually fighting in that. Yeah, we're going after him. It's probably not smart to go to Winterfell, but with the veil now. Or a breach in Winterfell. <laughs> Their army's gone. Our army's gone. Yeah. We have Winterfell. They don't have the men for siege. All we have to do is wait. We're, we're getting through. We got a giant, bro. That giant's knocking that door down. All right. Yeah, it's the giant. <laughs> Bro, just if the giant rips that door off and then the veil just runs right through, it's ah fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, oh. It, dude, this giant has taken so much damn. Oh, that's that's it. He's done. Ah. Oh. But everyone, everyone behind them though. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. That's all I would say. Now you rest. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Why are they gonna do us like that, bro? He was about to have... I right, fuck you, dude. Fuck you. <laughs> you suggested one-on-one -on -one combat, didn't you? Bet. Bet. I think that sounds like a wonderful idea. Nah, Range is gonna let his dogs out or some shit.
Damn, those arrows are going through their shield. <laughs> yes! 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 yes. Sansa's like, keep going. <laughs> Yeah, fuck your flag. Hell yeah. <laughs> we fucking did it. And yeah, Melisandre's like, he's him. He's really him. He's that guy. Ah, oh, his brother. I'm gonna bury my brother in the crypt. Next to my father. Aw. Where is he? Yeah, what'd you do with him? You didn't kill him. <laughs> it's really satisfying. Hello, Sansa. Is this where I'll be staying now? It's probably where I'll die. Your house will disappear. Mm -hmm. You'll be forgotten. Moon will disappear. All memory of you will disappear. I'll disappear into irrelevance. Oh shit. <gasps> oh shit. Hey, you haven't fed you haven't fed them in seven days. They must be ravenous. You haven't fed them in seven days. You said it yourself. Yeah, let's see. Beasts. We'll see how how loyal a hungry dog really is. Stop. Oh, 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 shit. Damn, just like that? Just right at his jaw? Fuck. Yes. yes. Hearing him scream, yes. Yes, queen. Yeah, it's queen shit. <laughs> Saw that little smile on her face. Alright! Well, that was Season 6, Episode 9. What a great episode. Top 3 episode, for sure. Top 3. I don't know what the other two are off the top of my head, but this is up there with them, so. Wow, what a goddamn episode. What a damn episode. Well, we did it. We beat Ramsey at Winterfell. We took back Winterfell. We did it. <sighs> took literally everyone. I mean, yeah, Valish didn't come through right there. If Sansa didn't go get him and come through, then like, mm, we would have died. We would have lost 100%. I wish, mm, actually, that's probably a really good time for them to come through. Well, we were kind of fucked. <laughs> you know, like ideally they could have been there from the start, but think about it, think about it. All of Ramsey's men, and that other house Ramsey was with, I didn't catch his name, but they were all circled around, right? Around John and everyone and all the wildlings. That's a- dude, that's so vulnerable for them. If someone comes and flanks them like that, like, yeah, it's extremely vulnerable. So it's actually a really good position to catch him in, but obviously not ideal for, like, John and all of them, but for the veil to come through, yeah, extremely ideal. I think, at least. No, we put in work. We did it. We did the best we possibly could with our 62 House Mormon men. They like I saw a couple of them. They put in work. I saw a couple. You know, I was trying to I was trying to look out for them and like notice them and stuff. They definitely counted. They definitely counted. <sighs> but yeah, once Ramsey fled back to Winterfell, I was like, oh, he's dead. He's dead. Sure, you could wait it out, like dog. Hell no. Based on what the energy we had, fuck no. We were not gonna wait that out. We were gonna ram through that door, that giant's hella clutch, for for just ripping that door open, dude. That giant took so much damage too. I like, it takes a lot to kill a giant, but you know, like right before Ramsey killed him, <laughs> I thought he was about to just like you know fall over, have like 
a, a nice death, but no, he got an arrow right to the eye. It's like, damn, that's brutal. You know, it's just like, thank you. Like, thank you for the work you put in. Like, and like, yeah, that, okay, that part where John, like, takes his sword out and he's like, going up against all them like by himself real quick like that one little clip i've seen that so many times like i saw that even before i even started game of thrones and like yeah when i first saw that i didn't know who that was but but yeah that so that's really cool to see that like actually happen in the show we reached that part of the show that's really cool you know i thought this battle was really well done i thought the way they shot it the way they edited it the color grading the effects everything like the practical effects of all the intestines all the probably what was cgi you know like it all looked amazing you know those intestines probably could have been cgi and they looked practical they looked like practical effects you know everything was just perfect in this this was such a good scene such a good battle scene this is just another example of why john is him john is that guy he is him he is him <sighs> i love john I want to get something to put on my wall to honor John now. Like, I've been kind of thinking about it, but I'm not sure what. But, like, now I'm especially going to. So, let me know what, what you think would be the best thing to put right above the blackboard. I'm not sure yet. I thought about getting, like, a banner, but maybe, like, a Winterfell banner. But I don't know. I want something, like, specifically for John. You know? Like, maybe his, like, his sword would be pretty fucking sick up there. But... Like his Valerian steel sword, but but that I feel like that would be very pricey, and I cannot afford it. So, just like something to kind of honor him would be pretty sick to put up there. And you know, it kind of sucks that Rickon died. You know, we tried to save him, but Ramsay got him. You know, he zigged when he should have zagged. Like R.I.P. Rickon. Yeah, I kind of figured we were never gonna save him. Like he was always gonna die. Like there was no chance we were gonna save him. <laughs> no chance. <laughs> So that, that sucks, but he'll be buried ne next to Ned, which is nice. You know, and like, that fight with Jon and the Ramsey and once they got to Winterfell, I thought that was pretty sick how he was, you know, he was using the shield and everything to get through, block all the arrows, but I kind of wanted them to have like a sword fight. I don't know, like, I don't know. I kind of wanted to see like a sword fight between them, but I'm still happy the way it, it went down. Like, it was still really satisfying to see Jon just block all the arrows boom get through just bump him and then just beat the shit out of him and then we fed him to the dogs <laughs> yeah let's see how loyal a hungry dog really is you know just like the joker said funny though because ramsey reminds me of the joker a lot so i you know i feel like ramsey should probably know that but and like thinking about back to the battle room before the battle happened when john and sansa were talking why didn't she just tell john like hey i'm gonna go get the veil i mean I guess, like, in her head, it wasn't, like, that wasn't a guaranteed option, you know? Like, Peter could have just said no, you know? So maybe she didn't want John to kind of rely on that. But, like, I would have told him, like, hey, I'm going to go try and get the veil, BRB, you know, instead of just, like, leaving in the middle of the night. Because I think after that talk, she went, th then she went to go get them, you know? Because, like, yeah, she understood we need more men and everything. I don't know. I wish she kind of would have told John about that, but hey, it worked out. It worked out. So it's whatever. I mean, we kind of a lot of people died. I feel like a lot of less people could have died. It would have been a lot, lot less stressful. But maybe it would have worked. Maybe it would all happen differently. You know, you never know. So just be. I'm just happy it worked out the way it did. So you know, one thing I love too is when they were all, like when they first met up. Ramsey was just talking, and then Sansa interrupted him and goes, like, sleep well, because you're gonna die tomorrow, and then she just rides off. That's all she needed to say, because she knew. <sighs> I love Sansa, too. I think, I think she's a top five character for me. I don't know the order, but just as much as she's overcame, it's like, I love to see it for her, so, like, I think she's a, she's definitely top five. I don't know the exact order yet, I gotta think about it, but then, like, yeah, earlier in the episode, uh, Daenerys, she accepted Theon and Yara's offer. So, that's great. I love to see that. And one thing I love, too, is, like, Jon actually went in there and fought with his own men. Ramsay just stayed on his horse and watched. You know, that's why Jon's a way better... Jon's just... He's a better leader. He leads by example, you know? That's probably why, like, when Jon said, yeah, his men don't actually want to fight for him. They're just scared to or whatever. Like, you know, but the diff that's the difference between John and Ramsey, you know, John can actually lead people and want them to fight, get them to want to fight for him versus Ramsey. He's like, he's like, no, you're going to fight for me or you're going to die. So you're going to die either way. Honestly, I think John might be one of my all time favorite characters out of anything ever, which 
is a pretty big thing, you know? He, he reminds me so much of, like, Anakin Skywalker. Like, uh, not okay, like, not so much about the movie Anakin, but, like, Clone Wars Anakin. If you know, you know. But yeah, that was Game of Thrones Season 6, Episode 9, The Battle of the Bastards. I think this is a top 3 episode for me, at least. So, comment down below what you thought about this episode down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.